Alright people, welcome back to some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's play in some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. So for those of you who are keeping up with this series, thank you. I really do appreciate all the views and support. I know that the weekend content is not what you're really looking for. I know I'm not supposed to be promising you guys Yu-Gi-Oh! Tier Draft League and live streams, but Yu-Gi-Oh! Tier Draft League, like I said, it's not going as swiftly as I want, but don't worry. Don't worry, we're gonna get to that. Uh, as for live streams, I actually got a new job I'm working on the weekend, so I can't really commit to that time because I got to work because I need to have some form of income while also being a full-time college student. Life is hectic, you know, and I wish I could make a living off of YouTube, but not even close. So uh, let me just go ahead and give you some good news. So Legacy of the Duelist, I went ahead and bought the rest of the DLC for Duel Monster. So uh, what we're going to be doing this episode is uh, the Arena of Lost Souls and Champion vs. Creator. Then next weekend, we are going to go ahead, because I got the other one, which is Doogie Pack. We got the Deja Duel and the Grappling with the Guardians. Then the weekend after that, we have the final duel, uh, Duel with Darts. That will be on Saturday, not next weekend, but the week after that. And then we're going to be doing one more thing for, um, for Legacy of the Duelist. And then after that... Uh, there's gonna be something that I'm playing on Sunday, I don't wanna give it away, but then after that, this series should be going on hold. We should be done with, uh, the, uh, Duel Monsters season for Legacy of Duelists, and we'll be moving on to other things. Either, hopefully, cross your fingers, is a return of Yu-Gi-Oh! to Draft League Season 2. I I've got the majority of the duels for Round 2. I'm um, just missing one, we get that done, we're already starting on Round uh, three, so hopefully we can be a month or two ahead so we don't, you know, catch up and, you know, have to put on hold again. So hopefully we can just get back to doing a uh, league. Like I said, I apologize for the last stream because I'm working, but hopefully I can at least get you guys league, which of course is the biggest, most popular thing on the channel. But thank you guys for being so cooperative and understanding, uh, despite that. So, uh, for now, let's just go ahead and continue on with, um, some more Legacy of the Duelist. So, like I said, I bought the pack. Uh, all, pretty much all the DLC for Legacy of the Duel, so we have um, back to Duelist, the Duel Kingdom here, uh, where we're going to be playing as Joey dueling up against, uh, I forgot his fucking name, and then of course we're going to be playing as Pegasus dueling up against Kyla, and that duel, I guess, the, uh, the reverse duel, uh, I don't know, I don't know, we'll find out, so let's go ahead and hop right into it, so, Arena of Lost Souls. Joey huffed and puffed as he ran in fear, he took a quick glance behind him to see Kyla's blue eyes white dragon barreling down on him. Blue Eyes was about to make a snack out of Joey when Joey woke up from his nightmare. A dream. Woo, Kaiba. Well, <laughs> well, we'll see who eats dog ch chow on this island. Wow. Everybody, wake up. Joey, what's wrong? <laughs> Nothing's wrong. It's a brand new day of the tournament, and I'm hot to find us a duel. Okay. <laughs> well, you don't have to yell about it. <laughs> hey, guys. What's all the commotion? <laughs> Good morning, Taya. Where's Mai? Isn't she with you? She said she had to go and to give you this note, Yugi. The note said, <laughs> said that Mai borrowed eight of Yugi's star chips. Well, you can kiss those star chips goodbye. I don't know. Maybe we really can trust Mai. If not, we're still the Team Supreme, right? Right. Okay, then move out. I wonder how many duels left on this island. <laughs> They shipped a couple dozen home yesterday. I bet even more have been eliminated by now. And some of them were really good players with powerful cards. We could be next. Not a chance. Not a chance, Hugh. Those other guys just wanted the prize. You and Joey have a lot more at stake. That's true. I gotta rescue Grandpa from Pegasus, and Joey needs the prize money to help his sister. The duelists we face today will be even stronger because they survived the first round. Even stronger. <laughs> Careful what you say, Yugi. You got little, you got little Joey here shaking his sneakers. What? You think I'm scared? Of st I'm scared, of little puppy dog. <laughs> well, if the color fits, oh damn! All right, break it up. You, you just bring on any duelist and I'll cream them. Right. You gotta believe in yourself, Joey. You gotta believe. Okay, no. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't know that they were being wide. We want to bend to Keith Cronin's bonds. Bones. I mean, bonds. It looks like bonds, but I'm guessing it's bones because he's about to be some kind of zombie duelist. We found two duelists. One is just a stupid git. Oh, he called you a git. That's obviously more of a British thing, but uh, yeah. But the other one is a good duelist. His name is Yugi. He's the kid who beat Kaiba. Everyone figures him to make. And all the way to Pegasus Castle. In America, <laughs> you get, huh? 
Yeah, I heard of him. He's supposed to be a little, a tough little squirt. If that is, if you believe his reputation. Yeah, he's never. We've never seen him duel. How do we know he's how good Yugi really is? Why can't I read? Hello, I'm super like super dyslexic right now. <laughs> All right, let's get into one. <laughs> uh, nobody's going to the castle except us. That's why I teamed up with the most brilliant duelists on the whole island. In America, that's right. <laughs> so if you want to win this tournament, you, you keep cool and let Ben and Keith do the thinking for you in America. Thinking of yourself. You hear me, Pegasus? Soon it'll be payback time. Payback for the way you humiliated me, me at the Duel Monsters Intercontinental Championship in America. <laughs> it all came down to, to you against me, and I had you right where I wanted you. I was sure I was about to win, but you scribbled some notes and called over a kid from the audience you're doing your place. Hey, what are you doing? Asking for help is illegal. <laughs> I don't need help. A child could defeat you Ben, okay? I'm going to prove it. Because mm. <laughs> I send the note to the kid, child. Just follow these instructions and you'll win. And so I didn't know what to make of it. We were just trying were trying to psych me out. What did you chicken out? Either way, it's fine by me as long as I take took home the prize money. After Keith played a card, the child looked at his note, followed the instructions, and took out the rest of Ben and Keith's life points. God damn. <laughs> what? You little snot nose brat. There's a way you could've known I was I was gonna play that card. Ben and Keith snatched the note from the child's hand. Give me that. It's all here. The card I played, I defeated everything. No! <laughs> you may have defeated me, Pegasus, but you cheated me. Nobody makes a fool out of Ben and Keith. You said you found two doors? Yeah, you gave him some dude named Joey. Good, we'll take the dude out first. Did you hear that? I think we were being followed. I think you're getting a little paranoid, Joey. You've been acting hyper ever since you woke up this morning. What the heck is eating you anyway? Oh, this is a lot of reading. Like, we're already seven minutes into the video and I haven't even played Yu-Gi-Oh! I literally was like, oh, the DLC is going to be a quick story and we're just going to get right to Yu-Gi-Oh! No, they're like, we missed this in the actual original game, so we need to put this in. I'm telling you, somebody's stalking us. Joey ran off into the woods. Where are you going? To stop them. And Joey wandered into the woods. He thought he heard something behind him. Suddenly, Joey, the whole world turned to black as he was knocked unconscious. Next thing he knew, he woke up inside a cave. What is this place? Welcome to the Rain of Lost Souls, abandoned hope for no duelist gets out alive. Prepare for your final duel. This arena will be your graveyard. The ghouls of the dead are all around you, Joey. There's no way to escape from your fears. Huh? Who says I'm scared? You can't hide the truth from the spirits, Joey. They see you frozen in fear. Okay, I was afraid, but not because of graveyard, your Ooga Booga Rat. Oh my god, the Ooga Booga Rat. Alright, this episode is officially called Ooga Booga Rat. Alright. <laughs> it's a creepy face that gives me the whiffs. Ooga Booga. Why does that sound really racist? <laughs> Grr, lay down your starships now. Hey, I never agreed to this duel. Tough luck. You haven't got any choice, dweeb. You don't stand a ghost of a chance. No. <laughs> There's gotta be some way out of this. I'm surprised he said this, not this. Wow, look how solemn Joey looks like. Got an interesting art. <laughs> you want to out? Well, then head over to your stalkers and crawl off like a, a scared little puppy dog. Joey remembered his nightmare involving copyright and came to the realization. If I run away from this, I really will be a scared little puppy dog. So I just have to beat ya. Four star chips. Let's duel. Finally. Shit, nine minutes into this video. And finally we are playing some goddamn Yu-Gi-Oh. Holy crap. Of course, you're playing as fucking Joey, so you already know this is gonna go to fucking crap, because freaking Joey's deck. Like, I get Joey as a luck based player, but for, for some reason, whenever I play as Joey, I don't have good luck. Like, I don't know why. It's just just the way that it is, so. Hopefully, I can open up decently. You know, Joey doesn't have the best of cards either. Like, yeah, look at this opening hand. I mean, we're doing against Bones. I'm guessing his name is Bones, because Bones, that wouldn't make any sense. Like I said, he's supposed to be like the. The gatekeeper skeleton dude, so. Uh, wow, 1800 level 5 monster I got a trippy summon for. Awesome. So, uh, I guess I'll just summon this guy. Like, look at, like, look at this hand. Like, at least I have Kunai Whip Chain, so. Hopefully, I can just attack with this monster? No, no. So, it's freaking illusion, and now my life points are all fucked up. Like, look at this. Look at this. Like, this is one of those times where it's like, you do the math, right? So. 
uh, increase the attack and so all monsters blah 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 all right so yeah that's all dark illusions bonds was more bones was the one who was played that card so all right that's fine i guess so yep so i'm gonna go ahead and increase some stat yep there's zombie master i don't remember that card actually being uh played then so could all chain is it 700 or 500 it's 500 so uh you're at don't you get an attack and defense increase or no all right so you're coming at me it seems like you're only 18 so it seems like if i activate can i uh no i don't want you to go defense so i'm just gonna go up to 2000 yeah and now you're stuck in attack mode, so I can kill you off too. Once again, Colonel of Chain coming through. Ah, well, sure, Baby Dragon. Sure, why not? Because this is totally what I need to draw, is fucking Baby Dragon. And the one time that I actually don't have fucking time with it, because actually fusing into uh, Thousand Dragon would not be a terrible idea right now. Yeah, look at our fucked up light points. All because of that Ooga Booga rap of yours. <laughs> Ooga Booga rap. Why does that sound so fucking racist? Like, I don't know why, but it really sounds like something very offensive to say. <laughs> yeah, sorry. You can kill him, I don't care. Watch me draw in time wizard. Watch. Watch. Okay. I say, if I drew in the fucking time wizard, I'd like, hey, I would just sort of wait to turn. I would just sort of wait to turn. Alright. So this fucking old man right here, this Koji Kosi? Koji Kosi? I don't know, he's putting in art. Just with that Kunamu chain, I got a 2000 beater. Ah, classic EO. When are they gonna update a uh, legacy? What? Alright, why do you have vampires? Came it wasn't even a card back then. Alright, alright, sure. Sure, fuck boy, sure. Yeah, so I'm assuming that you're gonna go ahead and summon a zombie and then, you know, try to attack me. So. I'm gonna go ahead and declare the attack. I'm gonna go ahead and activate Dust Tornado. Popping your Vampire King. Does it do anything that's destroyed? I don't think so. Yep, so. You take that. Damn, and you, you're just running right into me. It's the power of the Ooga Booga Rap. It gives me super strength. But yeah, it's freaking Vampire King because that card totally existed back then. Like, alright, sure. Give him updated shit and I'm still fucking playing with fucking. Fucking shield and sword. Like, what is this? What is this? Fucking Xyz2 and a fucking cowboy. <laughs> like, how can he get the new shit? I don't even get the new shit. Uh, okay. Oh, oh zombie master is of course strong enough to attack over me. Zombie master effect pitch to then summon another zombie master. Yep. Yep, yep, yep that's fine. All right. Can I get like pretty much any monster? No. All right. I was like. It'd be nice if I could pretty much get any monster if I can go ahead and just, you know, dark hole some of the monster and attack, but no. Like I said, I do not get lucky as Joey. Not at all. So, once again, I can go ahead and kill the zombie master, but then he can keep pitching and keep summoning with fucking zombie master. It's gonna get annoying real quick. You know, because you can keep going zombie master, pit some zombie master, zombie master, pit some zombie master. I don't believe zombie master is once per turn. I believe once per turn, but you, not a hard once per turn. So you can go... Zombie Master pit some Zombie Master, Zombie Master pit some something else, you know, which is exactly what he's gonna do right now, so. Yep, yep. So. Okay, there's almost anything that I can draw right now, but my sponsor, there you go, because I'm just gonna go ahead and Dark Hole and then attack you with my, uh, my Axe Guy. And then that should be game. Bones. Yep. At least I'm getting Axe Rider, he's pretty strong. GG. Yep. Hey. During the j duel, Joey's friends found the cave and cheered him on to victory. All right. Joey won. You did it. I did, didn't I? See you around, loser. But wait, boss. Beans Keith, maybe next time you'll have the nerve to duel me to me face to face instead of hiding behind your creepy flunkies. Duel you face to face? You're hopeless, dweeb. The game Duel Monsters is all about keeping your opponent off balance. When you duel, it's all that matters. Now, not how you go. You go about it. I don't know. <laughs> In America. <laughs> we'll see about that, Bandicoot. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm quivering in fear already, dweeb. What a jerk. 
Guys, I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to drag you into this mess. Next time. Uh, oh my god, that, what was that voice? Hello? <laughs> my voice cracked all over the place. <laughs> I know it just sounds like a oh, nasally voice, but still. Well, go ask what I'm trying to do his voice to be. My cough and brain. Next time, don't be in such a hurry to run off on your own. Eh, it's alright. We know it wasn't your fault, Jelly. Yeah, I mean, as long as he won the duel, we can forgive him. I admit, you had us worried at first. But you really came through this time. I got lucky, that's all. It wasn't luck, Joey. It was your determination, your trust in your cards, and the promise you made to your sister. That's what helped you win. <laughs> I only need two more star chips. Thank you, Serenity. So now you... So now can we get out of this creepy pit? You bet nothing's gonna stop us now. Oh my god, like so much reading and so many characters, so much voice acting. Alright, so we are done with this duel. So like I said tomorrow you're gonna be doing uh, this video right here, this duel right here, Champion vs. Creator. And like I said, next weekend we'll be doing Deja Duel and uh, Grapple with the Guardian. And then the weekend after that we're gonna be doing a duel with Dots on Saturday and then something else on Sunday. And then after that, Hopefully, I uh, will have all the round two duels, or at least, you know, the majority of them, which I do have the majority of them, we can start on round two of League, and then hopefully we'll get in round uh, th uh, three, and then, you know, Legacy of Duels can be put on hold, while Attack Force is pretty much our only Let's Play, and then we'll have League on the weekend. So, and finally, we can get the channel to at least some assemblies of what I wanted it to be, because, like I said, League is just a pain, like I said, babysitting, babysitting 16 people on top of my co-host pretty much doing nothing, you know? Sanzi is still away, and Slate, like I said, he said that he wanted to be co-host and help, and he pretty much hasn't, so rip that. So, uh, like I said, thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support, I really do appreciate it. Uh, you guys have been a huge help, uh, and uh, I wouldn't be nothing without you guys, so thank you guys for being so understanding and cooperative, and I will see you guys next time. I'll see you guys tomorrow with some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play, some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist with uh, Champion vs. Creator. Alright people, thanks for watching.